Most of the research that we're involved in is in clinical research. We are going to start doing some biomarker research, but the bulk of it is clinical research. Well, the changes in even in a short period of time, which is 10 years, has been enormous. The biggest change is survival. Clearly, survival is better today than when I was, was still in training in the late 90s. Well, if I was given all the money in the world, I would quit research and retire. <laughs> but I guess that's not going to happen. So if I had to do, continue to do research, which I love doing, by the way, I'd probably focus more on biomarker development and understanding the genomics better. And actually de developing drugs that are based on biomarker expression and uh, proteomics uh, related to cancer biology. I love the iPad. I don't get to touch it, uh, play with it more often because my kids have a monopoly on it. I can also tell you the gadget I don't like no, is my pager. <laughs> so. so about my staff, it, one inherent problem that I have with awards is that they recognize one person. But when is the last time anything ever happened on an individual level? Everything is a team effort, especially in cancer, especially in uh, cancer research. So while I receive an award today, it really needs to be shared equally with all of these folks at uh, Illinois Cancer Care. Also my family has to put up with all of this and the side effects of my professional career. Hi Dr. Thomas and congratulations on this award. We're so proud of you and you're really deserving. We're very proud to be a part of this great team and we nominated you for your outstanding compassionate care and your dedication to research. We're all proud to be a part of the SPT team and Dr. Thomas you are a quarterback. And even though we're part of all different teams, Together, we're one team at Illinois Cancer Care. So Dr. Thomas, you rock! <laughs>